Hello, my name is Javier da Corso and I will teach you today how to port a Flash game into a BlackBerry QNX game. For these examples I will show you a game called Tesoro Submarino that is a game made in Flash and Box 2D. The main idea of the game is to give it back to this shell, the pearls. So using the physics you have to try to put it back the pearl into the mouth it's not so hard but we'll try to do it over there so let's see how we can do this let's start okay here we are again and now we are going to talk about sizes if you have a web game it means that you have it on a web size now you need to change for make it work on BlackBerry 10 and in Playbook. So the change is really easy. First of all, you need to get it where is the weight of your game. Because I have been working it with Flash, we will see like this. I'm going to go to the Flash, I'm going to make right button and on document properties I will get it. So I'm using 900. So because I'm using my project SWC, it's really easy what I need to do, so I will go to Flash Builder and the thing is to add these two lines, what does it mean? I'm going to create a rectangle with the max size of the white and the max size of the height and this device size is going to be divided by 900, that is the white of my project and that is going to be the ratio. How am I going to use this? It's like this. It means that everything that I'm going to use on my project, I'm going to use the same height multiplied by the ratio. So you have to try that on your project first of all to use the right size. Okay, now we are going to talk about performance. One of my main problems was to put everything on the playbook and realize that it was so slow. And then I check the graphics, how they were made, all the movie clips, and I realized they were made in this way. What does it mean? That everything was in a different layer. It's like, I turn this off, turn this off, I turn this off and it's perfect, it's really clear, but it's really really hard to put this and have a good performance. So what should I do? Let's start all over? No, that's not the answer. So you just need to grab this and export a sequence of layers, a sequence of PNGs. So it's like this, it's export, export movie and you have to select PNG sequence you put a name over there and you will have a beautiful sequence of PNGs and if you put everything together you could have something like this that you will see is the same and so much lighter than before so try this, it's going to help you a lot okay an extra add for the performance should be to implement the graphic acceleration. That's really easy and you just need to go to your XML of your project, make it open and over here in the render mode use GPU. It means that it's graphic process unit and it's going to be much faster than before. You have to try that. Okay, the tips are over right now and that's it. You can imagine it's too little but it, what it took me to create this game and it's working now perfectly because you could touch in every part of the screen. It's working perfectly on a BlackBerry 10 and play in a playbook. Uh, it was as easy as I showed you before. You just need to try and you realize how easy it is to create a game on BlackBerry 10 or a playbook. So keep in touch, bye bye.